Hi everyone, this is Shannon from the Irishscrapper.com and today I have a um, graduate card for you. Um, so I, I needed a graduate card for an upcoming party and I was really looking at my stamp sets trying to figure out what did I have that would work for that kind of card. So I realized I do have a gap in my collection, um, but I was able to come up with something that I thought worked really well, so I wanted to share it with you. Um, this is, I used the Lift Me Up um, bundle on this project. So this was one of the Occasions um, bundles in our Occasions catalog. So this is on the retirement list. So I, I still wanted to show this to you because I love this set. It is so versatile and it's such a great one to have in your collection um, and really worked for me today to create this card. Um, so you can see here is my card and I actually have it in one of our clear envelopes. Um, I don't know, they just, it makes your project look so much more professional um, when you're either selling or giving, um, you know, it's fun. So I wanted to show you how that fits perfectly your card as well as your envelope. Um, so I've stamped my envelope and then I've also created this monotone card um, that says, you soar above the rest, congratulations. And then on the inside, I actually used a stamp from a paper pumpkin kit, one of our past kits that says Hooray Grad. Um, so this worked out so well, and I just love this bundle for so many reasons that I thought I would show you one more um, project with this set. So let me pack, put this back in to our clear envelope so you can see. These are in the annual catalog, and these are available. Um, you do get, I believe, 50 um, in one pack, so they're really nice to have. All right, so let me show you how I created this. I do have everything already pre-cut. Just to, uh, I am using the Knight of Navy cardstock. This is cut eight and a half by five and a half, scored at four and a quarter. And then I'm using a piece of the Lift Me Up designer or Carried Away. I'm sorry, Carried Away, Carried Away designer series paper. So this was one of the celebration items. So this is no longer available, but you can always create your own background using the stamp set. So just keep that in mind. Um, I chose to use um, this navy color. Let me find my, let me put some snail on this. Oh, my snail is empty. Okay, so since my snail has um, finished, I will show you how to do that as well. So when you order the snail adhesive, it will come loaded um, like this. And then when you run out, we do have the refills that fit perfectly into your holder. Let me just open this. And all you need to do is remove the cardboard and then snap it right in, just like that, and then you're ready to go. So these are great. I love my snail, I love my fast fuse. Couldn't be without it. All right, so that is the front of our card. Now I'm gonna flip to the inside. I'm gonna put in a whisper white layer. So this is four by five and a quarter. Okay. And now we can do a little bit of our stamping. So I do have um, two ovals already pre-cut. This one is from our Stitch Shapes, and this is from our Layering Ovals. The sentiment that I used on the front, again, is you soar above the rest. Congratulations. So I'm going to open up the Knight of Navy. I'm just going to make sure I've inked that up well. All right, and we are going to stamp that down. Yeah, there we go. Let me just clean my stamp. Okay, and while I have that out, I'm going to take that paper pumpkin, uh, Hooray Grad, and I'm going to ink that up in the Knight of Navy as well. And we are going to stamp that right in the center of our project. And then I have our um, little hot air balloon. And that is inked in the Night of Navy. And I'm just going to put that on its side a little bit, tilted. And put that in the corner. Oh, and then I'm actually going to do an envelope as well. So let me grab, this is one of our Whisper White envelopes. Let me pick up my 
tag there. I'm going to use that same balloon, ink it up so everything's coordinating, and I'm just going to stamp that straight in this lower corner. All right, let me just clean my stamp off real well. That night of navy is a deep, deep color. Okay, so let's close this up. And now we can go ahead and adhere our ovals. I almost said olives. <laughs> I must be hungry. Let me put our ovals together there. Let me see. I don't like the way that was laid. Pull that up. It's hard to see actually on the, let me set it here on the white. Yeah, that's so much better to see what I'm doing. Okay. All right. So let me give our card a nice crease. Okay. And now we have, um, I've die cut the large balloon from the framelits that coordinate. So you get this large balloon. You have all the pieces to cut um, to put in backgrounds for this balloon. You have solid balloons here, a bunch of different size clouds, the basket, a heart. Um, super fun. I love these. I love. All right, so I have my silicone mat here, and I'm going to use that to put my fine tip glue. like that and I'm going to take one of my blocks to hold that down and then while I'm doing that I'm going to grab a couple um, dimensionals to put onto our sentiment and then our sentiment will go right here in the lower corner just like that and that completes our graduate card. Isn't that pretty? And then I've also created um, a gift card holder that coordinates with this. So uh, I'll just give you a sneak peek of that. I've created a belly band and then I've stamped the hooray grad and then you can slip in um, a gift card or money into the little slot. Super cute. Okay, so if you would like to purchase any of the products um, from today's video, you can head on over to my online store. Um, the only thing that is not available is the Carried Away Designer Series paper, but you can always create your own background using your Lift Me Up stamp set. Um, so thank you guys so much for watching, and I look forward to being back with you real soon. Bye-bye!